Ladies and gentlemen, I'm Nogad21. Welcome back to Let's Play Kyaku Megami Tensei. We're almost done, ladies and gentlemen. I can't believe it. In the last episode, we were traversing through the gates of darkness here in surrounding Fly Village in order to get to Beelzebub's castle. Traversing the basement, we found Beelzebub, and since we had Bale captured as a tiny little frog, we joined those two together in order to get Ball back. Fantastic. Uh, and now we're on our way to go meet Lucifer. Since uh, Ball was kind enough, to, kind enough to give us the means to do so. Now the question is, can I get through here without getting myself killed? Let's find out. Uh, no thanks. Uh, you're gonna make me uh, fight you guys, aren't I? Alright. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. I'll kill you. Now that I can freely just walk to where I want to go. And not have to worry about finding any treasure. I could just kill these fuckers. If I could hit. Because apparently we can't hit the broad side of a barn. Let's see, from here we want to head down, and it's on the last door on the left. And Kimu we can easily kill. He says as our hits miss and they go first. Of course. Not to mention the fucking stupid targeting system that doesn't prioritize the lowest HP enemy first. No, it's random for some reason. God forbid actually, you know, attack the weakest first. Well, I got what I want. Oh, boy. Still taking a lot of physical damage, though. Even with the best armor that we can get, we're still taking a lot of physical damage, and we have max out vitality, too. What the fuck? I'm sure this guy hits hard for what he is. <sighs> anyway, through here. I just got done fighting you guys. Come on. Learn your place, you foolish people. <laughs> Alrighty then. If I can get out of here. Could we stop missing our attacks, please? You know, I was holding the cancel button game. No, I gotta heal f fully first, otherwise, as a chance of failing. Seriously. Stop missing the attacks. That's the main reason why we're taking so much damage and dying in the first place, because people keep missing things when they should never be missing at this point. Okay, from here, I'm pressing the wrong button for the map. This way. Get me out of here. Okay, back to the royal castle. Wee! Alright then. 
And now we head towards Remote Island. The one place that we have not gone to. Well, this looks familiar, doesn't it, ladies and gentlemen? This looks very familiar, doesn't it? This is where we met, where Izanami teleported us out of here in the first place. Alright, and this place is actually fairly straightforward, but uh, let me look at the treasure list, even though this is going to be very fucking easy for us to just walk through here. Because I don't think I got all the, tre the treasure here on our first visit. Okay, remote island. Treasure list. Second floor is a vitality incense, and that's it. Okay. And since uh, we we were easily able to dispatch these enemies beforehand, this is gonna be quick. Up the stairs. We just gotta get to the top of this dungeon. Oh hey, look at that. We already got it! Fantastic! Yeah, we had to climb all the way to the top in order to get out of here in the first place, so of course I would have had gotten everything beforehand. Okay, actually, uh, one thing I should do is uh, get rid of somebody. We're gonna get rid of, uh, Amy, actually. Because there's a good reason for this. Yeah, I'll just get rid of her. Fuck it. I can't fuse anything that's better than what I currently own anyway. Which is a shame, but Amy, get out of here. I'm getting rid of you for a very specific reason. Up we go. Yeah, and unlike last time, getting teleported out of here, we're getting teleported somewhere else. After we get rid of the cockatrice. The palace ring suddenly began to shine. I am Izanami. Now is the time for yeah. Now is the time to listen to the force within you. Okay. If we add everything, well, actually, let me say, let me rephrase this. Well, there's the temple that we need to go to. If. We acquire the palace ring and we revive Izanami, so that's kind of mandatory. Reviving Izanami, that is. We get sent to Lucifer's Temple. Fantastic. Izanami has appeared. This is Lucifer's Temple. Please present the five orbs. The five orbs... Yeah, a dazzling light shot on the five orbs became one. The Orb of Hope has been obtained. With the power of the Orb of Hope, I shall send you to Lucifer's Castle. You are my last hope, you two. Away we go again! Congratulations, now we're sent all the way back to the center. No, wait, no. Oh! The Royal Castle is not Lucifer's Castle. Oh, it's this thing. This is Lucifer's Castle, no shit. Sweet. New location just dropped. <laughs> now what? And I think Tink wants to go out of my room. I'm assuming that's why, because she's at the door. Well, I got a feeling she'll be back in a few minutes. Just a hunch. Okay, Lucifer's Temple. What are we dealing with in here? 
Well, actually, Lucifer's Castle is the true next spot I'm supposed to be in. Let's see, treasure, the first floor, and that's it, and it's a Soma. Okay. So essentially, we just need to find Big Buddy, uh, Big Bad Lucifer himself. Which is weird, considering I think his body is frozen in the real world. So I'm guessing we're going to be talking to his uh, astral projected self or something. Actually, how many floors am I dealing with here? Is this place just one floor? Or is it, uh, multi? Of how big this image looks. Okay, so we got... Floor 1, Floor 2, Floor 3, and Floor 4. So, four floors. Alright. Oh, good. Teleporters. That's fun. Okay, so we got a big fucking place. At the start. Oh, I see what's going on. I see what I need to do. So I need to go to this teleporter in order to gain access to the rest of the place, which will allow me to get to Lucifer. That's the same shtick as before. Fair enough, and we start here at the top, so from here, actually, we want to head over this way. V is for Valkyrie! Do I want to get Nikkei? Nah... Uh, unfortunately, ladies, I have to kill you. Excuse me. Actually, in hindsight, I probably should have grinded out some, uh, mag before we came in here. That should be fine. He says that these bitches can take a few hits. Of course, I think they might be a little resistant to physical. Well, there's two gone. There's three. And there's four. Who oh boy. Yep, I think I'm going to need to summon up some demons. The problem? I don't have the mag to have them be walking around. <sighs> oh well. Bylong, get in here. Kali, get in here. Chinglong, get in here. And, just because we can, Ball, get in here. Okay, from here, we want to actually get to the corner. Oh, great. Spin the win. Okay, next section. We want to go through this door. Oh, hi, Chronozon. Goodbye, Chronozon. Oh, hey, you don't look like an amalgamation of faces anymore. Or yet, I should say. Instead, you look like a fucking, uh... Imp that you see in, uh... Old Disney cartoons. Or Cuphead. Whatever. Volva! You're just a reskinned Gremory. Who can instantly kill people? And they reflect physical. God fucking damn it. Of course you can do that. Well, first of all, do this. That is not that much healing. Like, at all. How about Tetrafu? Let's try that. Bring back Asuka, please. Oh, 
Okay, let's try, uh, the electricity. Ow, no, Mazeodine. Shoot her dead! Let's try a Hamahan! Fuck it. These two are gonna do nothing, but I can't- I just got to attack- I just gotta swing! Can we get them on low health, please? Nice reflecting, you dipshits. Uh, is this gonna be another uh, place where I need, just need to run from everything? I better not have that be the case. hit by electricity, whatever shall I do? <laughs> Fuck your song. Yeah, that's what you get. Fucking Volvo piece of fuck. Okay, so Volvo is a problem and need to stay away from her. Okay, we go up the stairs. Da, 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 da. Okay, from here... We go in this direction. Up here. Chrono's on, we can easily just beat the shit out. Yeah, I definitely should, uh, save Revival for Ball. Oscar can heal the rest of the healing. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, this way. Go all the way to the end. Go up. Through. Not this door. Even though they both lead to the same spot. Okay, yeah, I do actually need to go to the store because I did not read that wall of being there. Okay, through here, up here, through here, through here. We could teleport back down to the first floor, but this is a good thing because we're in a closed off area with some stairs. And this takes us back up to the second floor. And now we need to head clockwise. After we get out of this room. Okay, so exit's over. Okay, counterclockwise, actually, because we're in the center. Oh, great, more Volvos. Well, now I know how to deal with you. Keyword know how. I just need my demons not to, uh, hit you with physical, but that's a pipe dream. Oh no, we've been put to sleep, what are you gonna do?
And Takuma's been affected again! That's great. That's fun. Could you stop fighting the enemy, you fucking dumbass dragons? You can breathe elemental breath. Use that. <sighs> it's just not worth fighting you, th you guys. It's not worth it. It's not worth fighting you. Lopla is not an enemy that's worth fighting. Not in my condition, anyway, with my subpar firearms. <sighs> Which is fucking annoying. Okay, from here we go straight through this door. Leviathan, we can kill you easily enough. <sighs> Let's see. When Asuka gains the ability to traverse to any, uh, tell any terminal. Oh, speaking of a level. Screw it. Put it into speed. Okay, we want to go through this door. Hi, Valkyrie. Um, not gonna bother. This goes by much faster when you have the ability to hit more than once with two characters. Decent amount of money. Okay, now we go counterclockwise. Rather clockwise. First, we went counter. Oh, whatever. We're here. Go through here. And here is stairs that go up. Yep. Third floor. Now, why is this entire section in yellow? Oh, that's why. <laughs> Can't see shit, Captain. Can't see shit. Okay, well, if we're from there... Doop, doop. Doop, do. Just run all the way to the end. Oh, hi, Kronos. Wait, shouldn't you be Prometheus with that fireball? Eh, whatever. It's just one demon. What's he gonna do? Okay, from here, turn and head all the way straight down till we get to the square. Okay, from here, go in here. And here is our stairs, I think. And if it is, then yeah, we just go straight and then we are at Lucifer, basically. Now then, let me see that enemy list. Lucifer's castle. Oh, that's kind of annoying. I was hoping Volvo would not show up here on these floors, but she has a chance to. Yuck. But I'll take Leviathan. Let's see. We already met Kronos. Loki can show up here. And set. And Azazel. Or Azazel. I can never say it right. Then again, I never actually heard it spoken in English before. Even during S Supernatural. Then again, I didn't really watch Supernatural consistently. Oh, this looks familiar, doesn't it, ladies and gentlemen? It's the fucking shit from the first game. Question, do you still got the spinny puzzles? Well, yeah. 
Yeah, you do. <sighs> well, since this is practically the same as the first game, Lucifer is right in front of us. So fuck it, let's go. Oh, hi, Azazel. You're just a... Uh, uh, you're just a spirit of flames. Well, at the very least, with this, we are getting a new upgrade to our sword. Actually, we're going to be getting two. Because after we do this, we can also get, uh, we can finally do the event that involves the knee hill. Man, Azazel, you have some health. You have a lot of health, but you give me a decent chunk of experience. Anyway, just to make sure that I have a slot open, and I do, I do have a slot open for a very good reason, and there is a good reason. Can you guess what it is? Oh, we're getting a level. Nice. In the next fight, hopefully. Lucy, I'm home! I have awaited you, Messiah. How many battles have you must have endured to come here? A lot. A lot. But why do you fight? For the sake of mankind? No. You're being manipulated by the one true God. I was once an angel and served at the side of the one true God. But for giving humans the gift of wisdom, I was cast down to the earth. A human seeking unsurpassed intelligence worshipped me over him. In his anger, he tried to destroy me and the humans, the fucking hypocrite. I fought to the end, but was sent to the world of demons. Baal was also once a glorious god Babylonia. However, the one true god sundered him in two. Baal was not the only one, of course. In order to unify the world, the one true god dethroned all of the world's old gods. Yeah! Yahweh in the Old Testament did not fuck around. Like, at all. <laughs> and exiled them as demons to the demon world. Now the time has come for humans and the old gods to rebuild their golden age. Son of man, will you fight by my side against God? Hmm. Do we join with Lucifer and tell Yahweh to go pound sand? Gee, I wonder which one we're picking, ladies and gentlemen. Now, in the first game, there was no alternative endings to choose from, so your only option was to face off against Lucifer. But, with what I've been doing, taking ba Bale and, as a frog and not killing him, making Ball rejoin back to his true form, and now, since we did that, we have the option of siding with Lucifer if we want to. This is actually a good idea, because I'd rather not face off against Lucifer, even though he's technically a boss fight. Yeah, sure, we're turning with- we'll join with the Morning Star. Hmm, I was so upon this upon you. Be warned, for it bears a curse, so use it wisely. Lucifer's sword has been obtained, the best sword in the game. Literally. Now we must deal with Satan in Tokyo. I shall crush Satan beneath my heel. Fantastic! Oh, we're back here. Anyway. Lucifer joins the party as a level 99 demon <laughs> with Zondime, Zeodai, and Tentrafu and very high stats. <laughs> Other than his color scheme, he's basically in his he Helio form. I don't know why they... I wonder when they cha decided to uh, change up Lucifer's uh, design. Ah, well. Much better than the original one, that's for damn sure. <laughs> Where it was just a palette swap of Michael, which is a palette swap of all the other Archangels, but whatever. Anyway. Return of... Ooh. Actually, what? Lucifer is classified as what? Tyrant? No, deity in this game. Interesting. 
And he's classified as a good demon. <laughs> oh, that's to be expected because Yahweh's a pretentious prick. Oh yeah, the sword. Lucifer's sword, an attack of 80, one day hit, male, and it has a star. Lucifer did say it was cursed. But uh, there's a sp there's a little there's a little uh, asterisk about that. You can only use this when you have a high enough intelligence score like his uh, armor. It says that's technically the strongest sword in the game. We're going to use it. Come to Papa. All right then. I say technically strongest because there's one that actually hits harder. But it's technically not as good. Anyway, let's head to the royal castle. We shall go inside and go meet a familiar friend. You sense a powerful presence. Uh, I guess we return Chinglong to the box. How much is it gonna cost us some Lucifer? Three grand. God damn, I need to fucking grind up money. Oh, hi, Masakato. The time has come to grant you my helm. Masakato's helm has been obtained. With my almighty power, I shall guide you to the other side. Back to the human world. Now we're back at ground zero. Now we have the best helmet. Fortunately, we don't lose the all resist because of the ultra eyes. We do gain a, a resistance to psyche, psychic attacks now. Whatever that means. Lucifer's armor, Lucifer's sword, Masakato's helmet, Hermes' sandals. I mean, technically, the only thing I need to upgrade in terms of armor is my uh, is the dragon arm, is the diamond arm. That's pretty much it. Let's see, we're going to be getting the uh, best gun in the game soon. So really, all I need to do is just gain enough money to buy a plasma rifle for uh, Asuka, and we're good on that front. Oh my! So that's what Psyche means. 50% revert... Yeah, resisting death. Oh, wow. It would help for me to read the resistance uh, key list here. All resist means we resist everything by 75% except for physical attacks. Psyche means we resist death and bind by 50%, and nerve and mind by 25. Neat. Okay, uh, is there anything else I should do first? Besides upgrading my gauntlet. Which, it really does need an upgrade since it's so trash. <sighs> the worst part is I'm not going to get any bonuses out of it. Or rather, I will, but I don't think they stack unless they do stack, in which case, fuck me! I'm rambling. Let's get out of here. Oh, hi, Genie. Goodbye, Genie. Oh, yeah, I forgot to look at uh, how strong our attacks swing for. Anyway, this is where Tiamat was. No shit. Well, actually, what I need to do is get the fuck out of here, because now we got some things we need to do first. We're in the Ginza Tunnels, actually. And I know where Satan is. Who is the one person that we've met so far that seems a little weird? You don't know? I'll give you a hint. Why do we still have Suzuki's business card? He's the odd man out. He's a named NPC that requires the business card to use. And now that we've met with Lucifer, is when this shit starts going down. 
So, Suzuki is a thriving businessman in a demonic infested world. If you can't tell it's Satan at this point, well, I guess you're gonna be wandering around for a while trying to figure out who the fuck do we talk to next. Now, unfortunately for me, I am out of uh, mags, so I gotta put everyone back in the box. Which sucks. But before we do anything else, though, let's head back to... The huge doom and suddenly disappeared! Now you can wander around as much as you want! Thanks. Thanks for that, but, uh, I am heading back to... Some diva guy said that they took a girl named Hiroko to Ikebukuro. Oh. Eh? You wanna know why the divas would talk to me? Because I have an inverted cross! I forgot that we talked to you on the way here. Now I just need to get out of here. Warning! Warning! Computer alert! Blah blah blah. Ow. Well, let's see how much we do it in terms of damage. Okay, 999 on a crit. Okay, sure. If I could get to the surface, that'd be great. Wait, I went through the wrong doors. Damn it! This is not the correct way. Home. Oh, oh, hey, a luminous sword. I know what I should have done. Hi, mutant. Goodbye, mutant. I should have took a terminal. But I didn't, because I'm a fool. <sighs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Hi, Opsaurus. Goodbye, Opsaurus. Wait, what am I doing? I can just do this. Just do that. Then, do this. Hooray! Now we shall teleport to... Forget where we're supposed to teleport to. Is it Shiba that we need to go to first? Because we need to head back to that dog statue. Oh. Da 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 da. Actually, we need to head back to Ueno, to be perfectly honest. Which means I actually do need to head through the frickin' Ikebukuro tunnels. Oh, that's so dumb. Why in the holy name of fuck? Can we not just go there? Man! Well, nice to see that the encounter rate is, uh, being a little high today. Should have just stayed in those tunnels. Should have just stayed in those damn tunnels. Ah, well, this is a good way for me to regain some extra money. He says. As I am slowly trying not to throw up. Oh, God. 
<sighs> then back to Ginza. I need to head to Ginza anyway. Well, the question is, do I deal with uh, Suzuki first? I mean, I probably should. Save game. Save here. Yeah, I guess we'll go take care of fucking Suzuki. Down we go. Since the enemies in here don't think, I don't think have uh, updated themselves. We're just going to ignore it. Alright, we're just gonna steamroll our way through. And I'll just summon on my party outside of Suzuki's door. Best part about running around in low areas? I don't need to have my demons out for it to be effective. Okay, gotta go this way. You'd think I've been through here so many times I would know this place without looking at the map, but, uh, nope. No, I don't do that. I do not do that at all. I suit you, Gumo. Wow. You guys survived. Impressive. What's not impressive is me missing my attacks. I hate that. Stop missing. Okay, you know what? We'll take care of Suzuki first. Then we'll move to, to back to Ueno. Close this out, I don't need this map open. That way I could uh, upgrade my sword. Let's see, from here, we go in here. We need to head up, I believe. Okay, open up. Down, narrow, 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 narrow. See, we are on floor B2. And, uh, we're looking for number five. Okay. Do, 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 do. Oh, this is one of those annoyances where there it is. There it is. Oh. Of course, we just gotta run all the way through this place anyway. You know what? I para basically so I don't run into walls constantly. Basilisk is gone, we know this. I believe it's gotta go this way. Hi, Bone Golem. Goodbye, Bone Golem. The fowls are always good for Mag for some reason. Okay, up to here. It's gonna take us down the stairs again. All right, down the stairs. Okay, now we're back in the tunnels. Did I want to? I went the way to Ueno first, didn't I, by accident? Well, we got a level. Oh, I might as well. 
keep walking down until we run into an NPC or we enter exit an area. Good god, this is annoying. Hi, right, Bugaboo. Goodbye, Bugaboo. Figures that me going the roundabout way is the wrong way. Ah, oh, whatever. I need to head to way, way no regardless. Of course, it'd be a lot easier if the place I need to head to wasn't surrounded by a fucking maze and stairs. That'd be making it a lot easier to traverse. It would also help that we did not take the long route to get here. Anyway. Now we talk to Lucifer. We head over here to this cave. Is this a gift from the moon? The sword Hino Kakatsuchi is stuck here. Try to remove it? Yes. The Hino Kakatsuchi has been obtained. Now then, the Hino Kakatsuchi is stronger than Lucifer's sword by a few points. With an attack of 97 and the hits of 2. So, you have two options for Takuma's final weapon. The Hino Kakatsuchi or Lucifer's sword. Do you want to have the strongest attack in the game, or do you want to have the ability to hit multiple times? Also, it depends on whether or not you are willing to put points into intelligence. Fortunately, unlike the armor, you can... No, way. The armor you can cheat out with stat bonuses. The sword you can't. Now, one of them... Whatever. One of them you can, one of them you can't, I forget which one. Anyway. Back to the real world. And I'll be right back. Uh, sorry about that. I thought I heard some scratching on the walls. Well, my door. But uh, no, no, that was just the squirrels and chipmunks that live in the walls. Thanks for waking me from that nightmare. You're welcome, lady. Uh. Excuse me. Anyway, back down we go. Now we gotta run all the way back. Uh, ay -ay -ay. Well, here's hoping no assholes get in the way, but they probably will, because, uh, fuck you. What's the most inconvenient is when the encounter rate jumps up to 11. And when you need it, it never shows up. Mark and endanger the beast. Do, 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 do. Well, I got my sword, so that's a plus. Too bad that Asuka can't use it. I got two powerful swords, and Asuka can't use a single damn thing. Which is why the Excalibur is her best weapon. Ah, <laughs> uh, best melee weapon. Her best uh, gun is the plasma rifle, which we can't get because we don't have enough cash. Fortunately, after we kill Satan, we get a the best gun in the game, so that's fun. Okay, down we go, and Suzuki is at the end of this hall. Perfect. Which I think it's this floor. Hi, floating head. Goodbye, floating head. See, yep, yeah, gonna want to go through here. And before I step in through this door, we summon up the demons. Lucifer, get in here. Bai Long, Kali, and Chin Long. Hello. Oh, wait, this is Lucifer's cage. I forgot. Suzuki's office is on the second floor. Ah, well, since I summoned them, I might as well run around with them. <sighs> Up we go. Next floor. Here's his office. 
That was close enough. Though I wonder what caused Lucifer to become unfrozen in the first place. Yo, Suzuki! There's a guard here. Will you talk to him? Yeah, we will. Who are you? Are you here to meet someone? Yep. Alright, come this way. Ooh, new section. Let's see here. Do 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 do. Uh. Down and arrow. Well, I don't know where we are. So I guess we're going this way. Stairs that go down, huh? Long hallway. Oh, hi, Grayon. You're not who I expected to see down here. Okay, well, I can close this out. I don't need this open anymore. Well, that was a decent chunk of experience. Oh, hi, Bylong. So we can encounter you naturally. It just takes us to, all the way down here to get there. Let's see. Down. Let's see. We're no longer in the expanse, so we're now technically we are in Ginza. Uh, am I am I correct in this assessment? Do 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 do. do. Uh, no, we're not looking at the shops. I'm looking at, uh, enemies here. Do, 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 do. Just gonna skip all the way. Ah, treasure, that. Treasures, n demons, here we go. Let's see, Ginza A and Ginza B. I think we're in Ginza B. At least I think so. No, wait. Hmm. I don't know where we are. We're technically in Ginza, so... Uh, I don't know where we're going, though. Oh, this is gonna be fun to figure out where the fuck I'm going. Oh, of course there's nothing here. Hi, Rongda! They fixed your goddamn resistance, son of a bitch. Ugh. Oh no, Bylong is affected by panic. I'm so scared of that. Ah, oh, this sucks. Well, I guess this is why Lucy's here. Of course, I wasn't expecting this to have another section. Wow, we're going to give some experience. What I was expecting... Oh, hi, Tiamat. Okay, well... This is a completely different area with different section with different enemies. Hmm. Okay.
Okay, well... Da, da, da. Ah! Suzuki Company Limited. That's probably where we are. Do, 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 do. Okay, we're now in the company part. And hey, level up! Puts it in speed! I'm gonna need more mag, ladies and gentlemen. Also... There's someone else we can get rid of. Tumon 10! Or uh, Lakshmi. I don't need either of you. So, Lakshmi. Tumbleton, be gone. There's a reason I'm getting rid of him. That's because we can get another ally for free down here. Matt, do me a favor and just die already. Well, I think it's safe to say that we found an endgame grinding spot for cat for experience. Yeah, that's a lot of XP. It's quite a bit of experience. More speed, please. And there's Tomomo no Mai! The one time I think she shows up as anything in this franchise. Whoa! Was she reflecting physical? What the fuck happened there? Well, okay, I guess we're healing everybody up now. What the fuck just happened? Huh. Well, okay then. Apparently Tom and Ono Mai was laying down the smack. Please listen to my story. Sure, decapitated head. Have you ever met President Suzuki? That man. You can't possibly believe he's a normal company president, can you? I found out his real identity and ended up like this. You should see the horrible, tr terrible truth for yourself. Yeah, that's not suspicious on him at all. We find a severed head and suddenly, uh, problems? Hi, Grayon. Goodbye, Grayon. Especially with that dopey third head looking at, to the side. Okay, we're going downstairs. Oh, goody. Ah, I know why this map is confusing for Ginza. It's because it has the Company Limited section on it as well. That's why it's so damn confusing. Where are these uh, X's supposed to be? Traps. Well, fortunately, we're immune to, st to floor traps. And these arrows are what? Teleporters? No, they're apparently stairs to go up, even though that makes no sense. See, A is an elevator. Okay, that doesn't help me at all. Uh, J is the boss. So, which floor contains the boss? Which floor contains Satan? Uh, ass assuming... No, it was talking about the... No, the J is referring to the freaking... Basilisk that we killed. We spin to win. Okay, we don't want to go that. Fuck it, just pick a direction and go. Oh boy, Rongda's here. Time to shoot her. 
Let's see how much damage Zondine does. Tentrafu! Okay, that did more damage than the uh, Zeo did. Gun, gun, Zundine, defend, defend. Yeah, I definitely need to upgrade my, yeah, I definitely should have upgraded my guns before I came down here, son of a fuck. Then again, I should have done that a while ago, but I didn't see the need. Well, at the very least, there's only one left. Too bad there's no way for me to uh, recover MP at all. It'd be nice if I had... Uh... Hang on, Lucifer just does an attack that's not reflectable? He has an almighty base physical move? The- what the fuck? You mean to tell me I could've just been doing basic attacks with him? Huh? Okay, sure! My other demons can't do that, but Lucifer can. That- sure. Why not? Well, that's gonna make taking care of Rhonda easy. If he doesn't miss his attack. <sighs> but hey, uh, we're getting a lot of mag and a lot of money. A rather a lot of experience. And the worst part is that uh, I am over my time. So, I don't have a lot of options. Do I keep going forward or now? Well, technically, I need to head west on this one. Down the stairs, I guess. Okay, I guess we're shooting the nine tailed fox spirit. Well, actually, the. Okay, so guns work. Really? You have Macaronda? Fuck off. Fuck you, Tamamo. Stop draining my MP, you son of a whore. Oh, sure, Tamamo doesn't give a lot of experience, but Rongda does. Speaking of which... Now that's some damage you love to see. Get out of here, loser. Can I go more than a single step? Without running into a random encounter down here? I love that. <sighs> well, round floor B5. So we're actually getting close to the end of the area, I think, based on this map. Well, let's go get another level. Let's put it in speed. And I'm surprised I haven't run out of mag yet. Okay, not in here. Uh, here comes Rhonda again. I appreciate the XP. 
but I don't appreciate fighting you constantly. <sighs> really wish Otto actually did the best action for everybody to do. But that's for later games. Well, actually, even later games don't do that. Their default setting is just uh, Blitzkrieg. That's their default setting. Hi, Bylong. Nice to see you again. You know, can you give me a horde of you? That'd be great. Especially when we just get triple crits back to back. Hey, we get a jewel. Alright then. Elevator. I guess we go back to floor B2. Huh. <sighs> This is my sacred battleground. Only the only way through is past my blades. Ashra, get the fuck out of my way. Lord Ashra, return to your original form. Oh, Lucifer, master of light, I remember everything now. Hmm. Human, Takuma, will you allow me to join your group? Sure. Ara Mazda has joined the party. <laughs> Moragidine, Moragion, and Zundine. You can see why I got Rotomo 10. Cool, another demon joins the fray for free. Oh, man. Now, is there anyone else that wants to show up? Uh... Da, 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 da. Do, 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 Okay. Now we can enter Suzuki's company again. There's a guard here. What we talked to him. Talk about a roundabout. Who are you? Are you here to meet someone? Yes. Is that so? In that case, I have no choice. You shall not pass. Oh, hi, Belphegor. I see you survived our first encounter, but, uh, get fucked. Be gone, bitch. Loser. Hey, another level up. Yoink. Master Satan! Oh, welcome everyone. I apologize for my guard's rough behavior. May I offer you a drink? <laughs> no. Oh, uh, I see. Too bad. Looks like I'll have to drink the rest by myself. Here's to everyone's future. Satan aimed through the glass through into the back wall. Lucifer forces way forward. Satan, it's time to end this farce. Or former hound of mine, you see we isn't quite far in this world. Oh. Could it be His Majesty Lord Lucifer? It seems I may have made an extremely minor oversight. You'll have to forgive me. And yet the fallen one has fallen even lower, a slave to these humans as well. <laughs> oh, Satan, you should be punished for your impudence. <laughs> you don't frighten me. Allow me to show you what true terror truly looks like. And now the curtain will fall on the legendary messiah as well. Oh, hi, Satan. Man, you look terrifying, and we are not in the best position here, because we do not have any MP. Oh, that's just great. Fortunately, this Satan isn't his, isn't in his uh, bullshit uh, Digital Devil Saga 2 form. So I don't have to deal with any fucking turn shenanigans. Oh, God. Yeah... Although, I am gonna, not gonna lie, I really prefer Satan in his, uh, weird blue snake form over this thing. 
Hell, I would prefer his apocalypse design than compared to this one. At least his apocalypse design is something different. Anyway, uh, Satan, what's your gimmick in this game? Let's see, uh, level 135. Goddamn. HP 2309. Hits everybody with your normal attacks. Resistances. Half physical, 2 8 gun, drains fire, 5 8 ice, 2 8 electricity, 5 8 expel, reflects force, nullifies ailments. Blaze, Moodoodyne, and Tentrafu. Oh, great. High chance of instant kill. Wonderful. So, I guess we're just gonna be spamming heals while Lucifer and Takuma do all the damage. Okay, that's 46. 79. How much damage is Lucifer gonna do? 70. Okay, so long as we don't get instantly killed, this fight should be easy. Fortunately, our helmet makes that coin flip. Make that. Eh. Makes that, uh, Moodoo spell a coin flip, I think. I guess it's normally a coin flip anyway. Eh, that wasn't that much damage. Okay, so Takuma does, uh, as much damage as Lucifer does on a crit. Yeah, this fight's good. just gonna be a slog. And once you look at that, we don't have an en enemy indicator. Wait, have we ever had an indicator for boss fights in this game? I don't remember. It doesn't matter. This fight's easy. He says before he dies to instant kill. Shit. Ow. Okay, the flame breath hurts. The flame breath really hurts. Fortunately, after we kill Satan, we basically have free reign to do what we want for a while. For good reason. Well, it's a good thing I was going to heal. Do, 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 do. I wonder if using a jewel would be faster. Let's see. I mean, technically, yes. You just keep uh, swinging that sword, Takuma. You keep swinging that sword. And he's gonna keep swimming that fire breath, isn't he? Nice, double crits. Of course, I would love for uh, him to be dead. Or, you know, Lucifer and Takuma to just basically crit all day, but uh, that ain't gonna happen. Well, I think uh, upgrading our speed stat does help. At least I think it's helping. Well, 
Well, there goes Kali. I'm okay with this. We finally ran to a boss and started killing our high-level demons. Took a while, but we got here. <sighs> um, Ara Majda, get in here. Uh, heal up the Kuma. Keep swinging. Sword. Sword. Attack. 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 Um... No, don't do that. Just attack. He must be running low on MP since he stopped doing his, uh, instant kill shit. And his, uh, fire breath. Man, you have a lot. When you have a physical resistance, this 2000, this 2300 HP of yours is uh, annoying to cut through. Seeing we're doing what? A hundred damage per turn? Give or take? Oh, now you do the fire breath again. That's what I like to see. More crits. We're doing a couple hundred points of damage every single turn, so... We are cutting through his HP pool. It's just taking forever. Can I get more than one crit? Honestly, I wish uh, the number of hits was always a guaranteed eight. But, uh, gotta have balance somewhere. <laughs> Yay! We got the final slay on Sat Satan! Final slay on Satan? Wow, I butcher that sentence. But we gained 30k experience. It's only enough for one level, though. <laughs> Let's have some more speed. Oh, Master Smite him with your divine punishment! Curse you, son of man, enemy of God! Be gone. Well, fantastic. Now then, I need. Before we call it a day, I need to head to the correct room because one of these rooms behind us leads to the final boss, the other leads to. The gun that I want. We're gonna grab the gun first. Okay, so turn around. From here. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. One of these is the correct door. <laughs> this map is saying the one to the side is the is the one to the boss. But this says going straight is to the boss. Okay, that leads the stairs down. Uh, you know what? I'm going to do the smart thing. I'm just going to quick save. <laughs> I 
Okay, da 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 da. Uh, the air shifted. Let's see, where does this take me? Turn back, enemy of God, your soul's impure. Okay. The air shifted. Okay, so we can turn back. Then what's down here? Then what's this way, then? Treasure chest! Megiddo fire has been obtained, which Satan received from the one true God. Fantastic, now we got the best gun in the game. An attack of 53 and hits everything. Oh, well, today was a, uh, today was a chore and a half, to say the least, ladies and gentlemen. I've been NoGod21, this has been Let's Play Kyaku Megami Tensei. And in the next episode, we face off against God. But until then, uh, thank you for watching, I warrant for leaving, and I'll see you all next time, and actually, before I cut it, let's see how much damage our guns do. Or rather, how much damage Vegito Fire does. 57. Wow, that's not that much damage.